champion Lou Ferris shaking hands with Johnny Valentine. Valentine has held the U.S. Heavyweight Championship, the Southern Heavyweight Championship, one time co-holder of the World Tag Team Championship. And note the caution that both of these men exercise toward each other. Each respects the other for his ability. Fez, campaigning now in the United States, had an extensive tour of the Orient uh, before returning to professional wrestling. He really never left it. He was in semi-retirement. Obviously in tremendous physical condition. On a strict regimen now. Knows Valentine trying to cross that arm across the throat and Fez fighting fire with fire. Catches him with a short forearm smash. The referee uh, warning him and Fez explaining uh, his purpose behind it, obviously. Again, Valentine moving in. Valentine, an awesome wrestler. Enjoys inflicting punishment uh, on his opponents. And the more you hurt Valentine, the more he seems to fight back. Again, collar and elbow. And again, watch Valentine coming across the throat of Lou Fez, trying to cut off that oxygen supply. Both men seeking balance, and it's uh, Valentine. A single leg dive, where Fez in that four-point stance, able to break free as Valentine could not maintain the ride. And Fez again using that forearm smash. It drops uh, Johnny Valentine to the canvas. This, of course, an extremely controversial match. A controversial and disputed pinfall, as we will see in just a moment or two. All right, Fez. Head back over those ropes by Johnny Valentine. And watch Valentine, one of those big sledgehammers across the chest. That stuns Fez. Again, Fez caught with that sledgehammer, but he fires back. Two good forearm smashes a third, and uh, Johnny Valentine rocked backwards now. Caught in the side headlock. Fez caught in the head. Valentine moving up, and so is Lou Fez. Both men, excellent recuperative powers. Fez looking that arm. Now watch uh, Lou Fez. He'll start a softening up process here on Johnny Valentine. And in just a moment, we're going to see that disputed pinfall. I might just point out, although it was a disputed pinfall, Lou Fez says he wants Johnny Valentine anytime, anywhere. There you have the disputed pinfall, and uh, the referee did not see it. Consequently, the winner of this match is Johnny Valentine. <laughs>